Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuveer. In this class, we will discuss about how to study theory of computation. Please watch this video till the end and share it with all your friends. That helps us a lot. So coming to theory of computation, the subject completely deals with how to write logics, how to think about the logic if there is no memory device. The subject completely deals with how computations are evolved with the evolution of memory devices. Let's take an example. If there is no memory device in your computer, how we have to think about the logic? That is what the subject starts with. If you are given with a stack memory device, how we have to think about the logic? If you are given with a tape memory device, how we have to think about the logic? So the how computations are evolved with the evolution of memory devices, that is what the subject deals with. So whatever the logical thinking you have previously in C language and data structures, the logical thinking that we are going to place here is completely different from those subjects. So you have to concentrate much. You have to do multiple practice examples here. With the multiple practice examples, you will get the good understanding about the theory of computation. So the subject starts with the first 20 videos are going to discuss about how we have to write the logics if there is no memory device in our computer. That is what the subject starts with. So students have to concentrate much on the first 20 videos. The first 20 videos are going to cover the concepts of deterministic finite automata and non-deterministic finite automata. So if you understand these two concepts, yes, remaining subject is completely dependent on, on these two concepts, deterministic finite automata and non-deterministic finite automata. If you understand these two concepts, remaining subject is very, very easy to study. You can simply watch the concepts, you will understand it, you go on. That's, that's how we have to study. Student has to focus much on the first 20 videos, watch them multiple times. We have provided multiple examples on DFA and NFA, deterministic finite automata and non-deterministic finite automata. Watch those examples multiple times, try to write the different uh, other examples on your own, design on your own. That is what you have to do in the first 20 classes. So students has to concentrate much on the first 20 classes. If you understand these 20 classes, remaining subject is very, very easy. So practice is much required in theory of computations. The complete theory of computation course is available at Learning Monkey. Please check our play, uh, playlist. Remaining, we, ha we are having multiple different subjects related to computer science. Please check our playlist. Please do subscribe to our channel and uh, hit the bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you.